Hello guys and welcome to my channel. In this video we're gonna learn how we can fix blend shapes for custom metahumans. We will try to fix the blinking uh, blend shapes for uh, our metahuman uh, which looks like uh, this. One second, let it load. Which looks like this. I intentionally customize the eyes so I get uh, problems with the blinking. So let's see how the blinking looks uh, right now. We open Poser and uh, we go to Animation Curves list and we search for Blink. And uh, let's, uh, uh, in this video, we're gonna fix the left blink uh, uh, blend shape and let's see how it looks. As you can see, the eye doesn't close completely. We can fix this by uh, uh, modifying the blend shape, the uh, blinking blend shape, and I'm going to show you how. Uh, now that uh, I have this eye blink enabled, I can save uh, this uh, to a bone snapshot, right? So let's click OK. I blink L. Just give it a name so you can identify it easily in the future because you're going to use this. OK. And uh, now, uh, after I save the bone snapshot, I go to the main window and uh, down here I have uh, the ability to load an asset and here we can load our iBlink left uh, bone snapshot. And we will see that uh, the mesh updates uh, immediately and now if uh, we create uh, a morph target, it will contain the delta between what we have here and what we have in the main window, right? So. Uh, let's proceed uh, with uh, fixing this uh, blinking uh, uh, blend shape and uh, now we can select bones. When you select the bones, you will see that it gets automatically selected in the list, uh, in the bone list uh, in uh, the right side, right? So if I select and move the bone uh, up, I can go and select another bone up just so they uh, uh, stitch together the uh, upper and the lower lid this is uh, the main target here and uh, I think for for this uh, small experiment this is fine uh, if you select the cluster of mounts here you will see that sometimes because they are overlapped uh, it will go uh, it will uh, select your eyelashes bones. You don't want that. And uh, you can, when the eyelash uh, bone is selected, you can uh, select the apparent bone, uh, which is the eyelid upper A1 here. And uh, you can do whatever you want, right? Just uh, make sure you don't uh, select the, the eyelash bone. So let's see what else we can do here. This is a corner can make it a little bit like this, right? I think it's fine for our video and uh, let's uh, save this. Uh, to save it, we first want to go to the morph target list and we will search here for blink. Well, we will get uh, some uh, morph targets here. And uh, what we want to overwrite is head LOD zero mesh I blink L, the left side, right? So we right click on it, on it and select the uh, copy names and uh, we go to new morph name and paste it here, right? And uh, let's uh, create the morph target, uh, which in our case will overwrite uh, this uh, existing morph target. You will be asked by Mesh Morpher if you want to overwrite it and select yes. Okay, and after you overwrite uh, the, the morph target, you can test it out. Let's enable the eye blink now, and you will see that it closes uh, correctly, right? So uh, let's uh, see uh, what else you can do. Uh, you have uh, several uh, animation curves, and uh, what uh, you want to work with are the one with the prefix uh, controlled CTRL, right? 
and uh, you want to test the blink, the look arounds. Uh, this is uh, the main uh, uh, aspects that uh, you want to test. Uh, let's see. I look up as well. I look down. I look left. These are the ones you want to test, right? See, uh, when uh, the eye looks up and it's closed, you want uh, to fix that. Let's uh, disable the blinking. And this is how it looks, right? You want to add a little bit or, or fix this uh, right here. You can use poser or you can sculpt or whatever you do. So this is how you fix the blend shapes. I hope uh, it makes sense. Don't forget to disable the snapping, right? For location or rotation or whatever, or change the value to whatever you want. So you can have a better accuracy when you're moving around the bones. And uh, yeah, this is it. And uh, see you around. Bye.